All right, my people, my people, happy Monday. Hopefully, you all had a good weekend and a beautiful, good day today. I sure did. Let's get after it. So we're just going to call this episode one, get you some. Let's start from the top. We've had a good past, uh, good five days since Thursday. If you've been sticking with us, if you've been on this train, uh, the train has been a gravy train. And it's always nice to have. Taking a look at Bitcoin. Let's talk about being a step ahead. So we here have had an edge because we've been a step ahead. The Chinese dragon, here, let me get rid of this. Let me get rid of this. The Chinese dragon triangle, we were a step ahead because everyone else was on the previous triangle and they were seeing this breakout, right? The triangle like ran down here or something, right? It was like, it was like this or something, right? Or down here. And they were, oh, it was breaking out, right? But there was a new triangle, the red dragon arched its back a little bit it got close to the dragon got burned and now there's a little more now there's a little space again we shall be burned now come on there there we go there we go now the red dragon is going to continue to arch its back so we have to adjust to be one step ahead. So where does this triangle come from? The last two points. Okay. So I am in light shorts right now, right? If you followed us, our directions were to A, take profit from Thursday, Friday. I took all of my profit Thursday, Friday, Saturday. We entered in some trades on sunday looks like they're doing pretty good looks pretty good down here i don't know you tell me um so as far as bitcoin goes we are where'd the red dragon go okay as far as bitcoin goes if you're trying to be super safe you can enter shorts on the red dragon or on the phoenix birth of a dragon the girth of a dragon after it arches its back okay this would be super safe these would be super safe shorts so that's eh, 6500 and it's 6500 6480 very excellent shorts if you could catch one up here might be might be not a bad idea to have one up here right red dragon obvious shorts right now, when for those who, of you who are longing right now, it's not that you're going to be wrong in that a candle might not psh, spike up and hit it, but that's all I expect it for it to do would be to psh, spike up and hit it. If it does, if it does. So have your orders set on the books. Be the market maker that you want to be and set shorts if that's what you plan on doing i'm not telling you if, if that's what you're gonna do okay um for those of you that feel like you missed a party you know, you know whatever i think we're gonna continue to keep going sideways and down sideways and down with the occasional hair up so protect yourself from being liquidated from those hairs up make sure you're not using too much leverage what's next yay ADA! Are we recording? Okay. Now, ADA has been very good to us since the head and shoulders with the flick that we called. Remember, we drew it was like this flick, and then boom. And we shorted right here, baby. Anyways, then we drew the Chinese, a Chinese Chong, right? That connected like this. Which it basically played out. Now, for people that are standard TA, non Chinese TA, 
it's probably screaming long. And, you know, I have a short in it because I know that most people that use standard TA in times like this end up being wrong. I do not recommend you short ADA right now. This is a gamble. This is a true battle of principles. This is going to give me a tell again. We got a tell from Cardano uh, Thursday that it was not following standard TA. Like it normally cryptos don't. But I always refresh myself. It is following Chinese TA. So in Chinese TA, I'm expecting I'm expecting people to get wrecked. That are doing what everybody else is doing. Bitcoin Cash, baby! Bitcoin Cash! Let's talk about Bitcoin Cash. All of the hash. In fact, I believe like 70%. Maybe even 80% of the hash power is mining Bitcoin Cash SV. So if BitMEX is showing Bitcoin Cash ABC and SV is getting all the hash power, I don't even know um, if actually, I don't even want to say this. I think, you know what? If you want, my trade of the month send me a private message and uh maybe we can work something out trade of the month baby trade of the month message me personally we'll we'll work we'll work a deal all right let's see what else is happening here ethereum remember ethereum is the new bitconnect ethereum is bitconnect everyone's got some ethereum Currently, is my personal misery index. Since everyone's got a piece, Ethereum is heavily owned by the people. By the people. So therefore, it is a reflection of the people more than the other coins. Now, this tells me exactly how I'm feeling, which is benign. Which is probably how you're feeling. You are probably not too anxious and not too excited. You are not too happy and not too sad. You are right in the center in sort of a void. So Ethereum is BitConnect and my personal misery index. I believe I have a short on Ethereum right now. I'm expecting I'm I'm looking I'm looking for like a move down to 200 to exit this trade. I'm looking for like a 201 202 to be safe. 201 202. Um I think that's it. I think that's it for Bitmex today for now. It's a pleasure to serve and 99 eh, i'll say 95 percent 95 percent of my audience um i just really want to say i appreciate you guys every time you write a comment and uh you know you say nice things um just know i see i see it all and um just because i don't message don't mean i don't see you so let's keep this ball rolling we're on a nice hot streak right now, um, and we are betting the trend. The trend is your friend, and right now, my trend, the, the, the crypto face trend's going pretty damn good, baby. Peace.